Hello, my friends, my tiny friends. It is picture book break time, and I'm going to read you Jilly and Jigs. This is one of the Monio family books that's quoted the most from our childhood, and also uh, one of the best ones. And I love it very much, and I hope that you all love it as much as we do, and we have since we were little. All right, this book is called Jillian Jiggs, written and illustrated by Phoebe Gilman. I'm at a different angle, so it's a little harder to, right now, but I can't change it. This is Jillian Jiggs right here. She's bowing. To all mothers, especially mine. And there you go. There are some kids and a rainbow. All right. A long time ago, when she was quite small, Jillian Jigs wore nothing at all. That is a tiny baby boot talk. Those were the days, her mother would sigh, as she looked round the room and started to cry. For Jillian Jigs liked to dress up and play. And this made a mess in her room every day. Jillian, Jillian, Jillian Jigs, it looks like your room has been lived in by pigs. Later, I promise, as soon as I'm through, I'll clean up my room, I promise, I do. Now, Jillian meant every word that she said, but later that promise flew out of her head when Rachel and Peter started to shout. Jillian had to, just had to go out. at the boxes. Yippee! Hooray! It's hard to believe someone threw these away. I'm mad about boxes. Boxes are fun. No one will guess who we are when we're done. No one would guess, but her mother would know. A mother can tell by the tip of a toe. Look at that cool things that they made. And there is her mother. Her mother's good shoes. I like that Jillian and her friends are creative. Jillian, 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 Jigs. It looks like your room has been lived in by pigs. Later, I promise, as soon as I'm through, I'll clean up my room. I promise, I do. She is being drugged back in the house with her little robot self and her flippers. Her mother is not happy. We'll help Mrs. Jigs. We'll do it. Don't worry. We'll all work together. We'll clean in a hurry. They started to clean up her room, and it's true. They started to clean, but before they were through... Jillian thought of a game that was new. They had to stop cleaning. What else could they do? Let's dress up as pirates. The sails to the bed. Tie sails to the bed. Heave ho, you landlubbers. Full speed ahead. That looks like fun. They dressed up as dragons. They dressed up as trees. Look how creative they are. Okay. 
They dressed up as bad guys who never say please. They dressed up as chickens cooped up and caged. This is where their bad guys, this first picture is, and then this is where their chickens. They turned into monsters who hollered and raged. They cackled like witches. They stirred and they boiled. So here's where they dressed up as monsters who hollered and raged. these monster feet and this is where they dressed up as witches who cackled and boiled then they were royalty pampered and spoiled they twipped they tiptoed and twirled like little light fairies They made themselves wings and flew like canaries. Whatever they thought that it was, whenever they thought that it was, they were through. Whenever they thought that it was, they were through. She'd change all their costumes and start something new. Looks like she's doing a play. Then Jillian's mother came in with her mop, took one look around, and... She fainted Ker plop. Oy. Good gracious. Jillian, Jillian, Jillian Jigs, it looks like your room has been lived in by pigs. Later, I promise, as soon as I'm... Start cleaning this minute, this second, not later. I want this room tidy. I want this room straighter. You better go now, Rachel and Peter. I'll see you tomorrow when everything's neater. And that was that book. I hope you guys loved it. The pictures in this book, when you look at all of their cool messes they make and all their fun games that they play, are is so fun. Plus, Jillian, Jillian, Jillian Jigs, it looks like your room has been lived in by pigs, is, you know, now you know where it came from if you've heard it before. And it is one of our favorite books in our family, and I hope it becomes one of yours. And I love you very much. 